Tiger pounces on another 54-hole lead, and he's the man to beat Sunday at the Buick Open. Welcome to PGA Tour Today, presented by World MasterCard. The performance wasn't textbook, but the charge was vintage Tiger at Warwick Hills. Hey everybody, thanks for being with us here on PJTour.com. I'm John Swantek. A lot of action on moving day at the Buick Open, and the 2002 and 06 champion Tiger Woods made a big move closer to his third title in Michigan. Despite a frustrating day with the driver hitting only five fairways all day Saturday, Woods was able to manufacture enough clutch shots like this one at 13 from 178 yards away in the fourth fairway. That beauty there produced one of his eight third round birdies, one of which came on the Kodak Challenge hole, the par three 17th, as Woods dropped the hammer from 33 feet on the way to a 65. Tiger begins the final day with a one-shot lead. Today was a, a scoring day. <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I hate to go in the front nine, uh, but the back nine, I hit some loose shots, and it was just uh, just scrambling and trying to trying to keep pace. I mean, these guys are just making birdies everywhere. One of the guys Tiger will be looking to shake on Sunday is Michael Letzig, who would have had the first 54-hole lead of his career until an ugly double bogey at 18. But still, he's riding high after his first top 10 of the year last week at the Canadian Open, and Letzig went out of tear in the middle of his round Saturday. Birdieing 8, 9, 10, and 12, he finished with 68. And for his efforts, Letzig gets a final round pairing Sunday with Mr. Woods, whom he trails by a shot. Here's the tail of the tape between number one in the world and number 200. Now these two were paired together in the final round of the Memorial earlier this year. Ledzig shot 75 and finished tied for 14th. Tiger a 65 and the title. Woods is an astounding 46 of 49 in his career, turning 54 hole leads into victory. John Sendon begins Sunday two shots back. Matt Bettencourt and Vaughn Taylor are three off the pace. Now for more from Grand Blank, let's go to our man on the ground, Fred Albers from the PGA Tour Network on Sirius XM Radio. Well, Swanee, this is where the battle will be joined in the final round on Sunday. The par five opening hole, Tiger Woods paired with Michael Letzig. Remember after the opening round, Tiger Woods was tied for 94th. There was questions whether we would make the cut. Well, going into the final round, he has sole possession of the lead. Remember the great words of Ben Hogan? He said there's three ways to win a golf tournament. You can outwork your opponent, you can outthink your opponent, or you can intimidate him. And I would say all three will be in effect with Tiger Woods playing in the final group with Michael Letzig on Sunday. You can catch all the action on PGATour.com and the PGA Tour Network, Sirius XM. Our broadcast begins at noon Eastern time. All right, thanks, Fred. You can also catch the final round on the Golf Channel from 1 to 2.30 Eastern, and then hop on over to CBS from 3 to 6. And, of course, stay with PGATour.com throughout the day for final round updates from the Buick Open. Your World MasterCard comes with rewards, offers, and perks that matter to you. Whether it's tea time reservations at Premier Golf Courses or tickets to the big game, you decide what's in your perfect world. Offers may vary. Go to Priceless.com world and register for more details.